Well, first of all, in terms of European immigration, we celebrate the free movement of people in the EU. And as Nicola alluded to, many Britons have been able to take advantage of that to do what they want with their life. That's a real plus. But if we think about non-EU immigration, what we need is a controlled but fair and humane system. And that's not what we've got now. Just take one example, the fact that a quarter of appeals against asylum refusal, people who've often been victims of torture in their own country, these people, we've come here, we've left them for years, and then eventually say, yes, you are a refugee after all. Now, I think when people talk to me about immigration, they often say they're concerned about three things. They're concerned about low wages, crowded schools and hospitals, and housing problems. All of those are important, critical issues we need to deal with, but they're not caused by immigration. They're caused by failures of government policy. 